In this video, I will show how to copy from Excel and JMP to another JMP file. First, we create a new data table. You can go through the menu, File, New, Data Table, or just use Control N. I can select one column by clicking on the column header. Just make sure that the entire column is selected and copy. Control C, the PC will do that and then select the already created column and paste. Key combination Control V will do that. This will copy the data but not the column header. We need to change the column header manually. I can also select multiple columns and copy them. But then before that, I have to create new columns. Right now, we have just one column in this new file. I have to either go through the menu or simple way, double click the headers and create new columns. Let's say we have three columns here. And you're going to copy three columns from this file, selecting the headers, all three, and then Control C will copy. Here we need to select all three column headers and then paste Control V, and then manually change the column headers. We may copy columns from Excel as well. File new data table. We have candy bar file saved in Excel. We can select the entire data set and copy it. To copy all the data and the column headers, go to edit, paste with column names. This is important to select paste with column names. Otherwise, if you select paste, your column header will be copied into the data grid, which is not right. Paste with column names. So we can see the column names are on top, and then the data grid includes the data only. When copying data into JMP, the system decides about type of the column based on the data. If it's character, it will be nominal. If it's number, that will be continuous. So an all number column being copied, and it should be a nominal variable. We need to go in and change it from continuous to nominal. And one point about selecting data and copying data. When you try to select one column in JMP, at the same time, you have clicked on the row header somewhere. You have selected a row you can't easily select the column again. So any column header you select, you will only select the cell at the intersection of that row and column. To clear the row, you need to go to Rows menu, Clear Row States, and then you can select the entire column. 